Hi, my family, and welcome to this video. And if you're new, welcome. I'm very happy to see you here. I hope you subscribe and be part of Didi family. Today, I'm going to talk about a new Swedish brand. I kind of made a couple of reviews on my channel with products from that brand, but they actually released two new eyeshadow palettes, and I have both of them here. One is with some a couple of mattes and kind of satin finish shades. They don't look very glittery, but we'll see, or metallic, but we'll see how they're going on the eyes today. And another palette that has matte and glittery shades in. Very nice packaging. It's called Pract. Their brand is called Pract. They have a nice mirror in here, and here is the color of the shades. I'm going to do a video with only this palette on Friday, I think. No, maybe another day, but today I'm going to try this palette. This is more sleek. This brand is cruelty free. They are going to expand their shipping, so soon they'll be able to ship in Europe and US, and I'm very excited, excited about that. As soon as I heard about this brand, I started buying their products. I bought one eyeshadow other eyeshadow palette that I love and reviewed on my channel this and some of their or all of their new eyelashes and uh, lipsticks and I love that brand. So when I saw this palette that I just showed you and this one, I had to buy it. Look how nice these are. They have a couple of matte shades. I think this one, these two are matte and this one, this one, and this one is matte. The other look more like satin on satin finish. I don't know how to explain, but we'll swatch a couple of them. These two I do need to swatch because they look very similar in the pan. I like the packaging. Uh, it looks like they have different undertones. Undertones are very similar, but actually they're kind of similar. Uh, let me see. Let me swatch a couple of other shades. Let's see if we can swatch this blue one and this purple. They are nice, very soft. This looks more like satin finish. I will see how they are going to work on wet. This one I do want to use on my eye today. Kind of like it. This blue one is a little bit chalky, but they look nice. Pigmentation is there, but we'll see how it's going to perform on the eyes. I want to swatch a couple of matte shades too, so let me just clean my hand. You're very soft, I like that. They look nice, but we'll see how they are going to work on the eyes. So if you want to see me creating a makeup look with this palette from Pract, uh, brand, then please keep on watching. So I'm going to put Urban Decay Primer on my eyes and prime my lids. I only have my eyebrows on today. I kind of uh, went to the store this morning and had some very natural looking makeup because I knew that I'm going to film this video, but I can't go outside without mascara or just something on the, my face. I've been loving this Revolution powdery powder foundation. I've been loving that. I need to buy backup because that one is amazing. I just took it with a big fluffy brush all over my skin and it gave me that nice even tone, but looking like I don't have any foundation on. I love that. So I'm going to go in with this palette. I'm going to this first shade. I don't have names for the eyeshadows, which is something I'm kind of sad about because when I do videos, it's easier to just say the name of the palette, but sometimes the names are too hard and I can't pronounce them. And this mirror in here is very nice. I'm going to set my eyeshadow or my primer with this eyeshadow. And this is a nice kind of... Uh, soft pink very soft almost like my own skin tone so a little bit powdery but i don't care okay then i want to go in and 
Oh, I wish they had more matte shades in here. I'm going to go in with this pink shade. And try to build that in our crease. These shades are pigmented but very soft pigment so you can uh, build up uh, build up how intense you want this shade to be and that is what I like about their eyeshadows. Their eyeshadows stay on my eyelids the whole day at least 14-15 hours and I love love that. They are so easy to travel with. So let's go in with this shade here. I'm dipping up my crease a little bit and also building up this shade in the corner. We're taking a small bit of brush. This is from Kaya Cosmetics number two brush and I'm going to go into this gray black shade. It looks more like gray and deep up a little bit. These palettes are perfect for, be for beginners because they are very easy to build up but also are not hard pigmented or too pigmented so you can't work with it and you mess up your makeup look. You have more control. Whoop, I lost the brush. Taking that brush that I had before and without more eyeshadow I'm blending just this. I don't want it to be too harsh. Then I want to actually go in with the cut crease canvas from Revolution and kind of cut the crease a little bit. I feel like for that today. So I've been loving this brush from uh, Sosu Esco 05 for packing on the shimmer or metallic eye eyeshadows on my eyes. And I'm going to take this peachy shade that I think it's so beautiful in the pan. And not I'm not going to wet the brush. A lot of the pigment comes on the brush. I'm not going to wet, wet it. I'm going to try it dry. Oh wow. Oh, this is more metallic than I than it looks on the in the pan, actually. I'm very surprised. Well, I love this shade. So I bought this palette just for this shade and because I want to support this brand as much as I can because I love their products. They are affordable, cruelty free and so fast shipping. Customer service is amazing and I just want to show my support and love to the smaller brands that are working hard to create beautiful products. So I want to wet the brush just to see if I can get it more metallic but it and it has a lot of fallout but it doesn't kind of bother me. definitely more intense and just to say you guys on Wednesday I'm going to do a giveaway on my channel and this palette is going to be in that giveaway of course new this is mine I bought two one for me and one for the giveaway because I want you to be able to try something from Sweden even if it's not possible to get it outside right now but it's going to be they're working on expanding the shipping locations and I love that. So I'm going to go back with this brush and go in with this shade 
and kind of not blend the edges a little bit. I'm going to clean under my eyes. There is not much fallout, but I just messed up here and I want to clean that. So guys, I'm back on my face. I have this Revolution foundation, that foundation and also the concealer from Revolution. I just filmed a review with these powders that is coming up on my channel this week. I think it's going to be up on Friday. And I just said that my makeup and my under eyes with those powders. And then I went in with Shook Revolution Shook new eye highlight, pa highlight palette. And also on my lips, I do have this peach, Too Faced Sweet Peach lip gloss in shade Peach Tease that I've been liking a lot. And uh, yeah, let's go back to the palette. To, and I'm going to use this shade under my low lash line. And then I'm to going to go in with my brush and go into this peachy shade here. And I don't have anything to put in my, in the corners here. So I'm going to go into Revolution Shook Highlighter Palette and I'm going to take this white shade. I'm going to put some mascara on and I'll be back. So guys, this is the final look. So guys, this is the final look. I really love how this makeup look turned out with this palette. I think this palette is wonderful. Very easy to use. It's very beginner friendly. Uh, the pigment is there, it's not too hot, too much pigmented, so you can't work with it, and it's kind of easy to build up. So if you want that strong pigment right away, maybe this palette is not for you, but if you want to be able to build up your eyeshadow, build up how intense you want this to shade to be, then it's perfect for you. I really like this makeup look. I really, really love this shade on my eyelid. I've been looking for that kind of shade for a long time, and I... I'm very happy with this palette. I love it. It's going to be in my next giveaway on Wednesday So don't forget to subscribe and check that video out Participate and maybe win this palette and many other beautiful products But guys that was everything I had for you today. I hope you liked this video If you did give a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe and I see you in my next video. I love you all. Bye